Hello and welcome to Exotic Wine Travel. I'm your host, Matthew Horky. I apologize, we're here in Bali, Indonesia. We were doing some work and the microphone busted. So I have to record a couple of videos without my microphone, so the audio is not gonna sound as good until we get that fixed. So I'm here in Bali, Indonesia. We're next to a monkey forest. So if a monkey jumps onto my lap, don't be alarmed. Maybe you can get a little bit of a view of what we're seeing here from our hotel. We're on the third floor here in Ubud, Bali, Indonesia. Ubud was made famous by the Elizabeth Gilbert novel, Eat, Pray, Love. The last part of her journal was taking place here in Ubud. So it's a pretty cosmopolitan feel for a big, for a small village. So <clears throat> it's so funny, even here in the tropics, wine is being made and I'll go over that in a few episodes. But I'm just going to share a couple things with you guys. First of all, we were out, Sharita and I were out, we wanted to have something nice to drink. Indonesia, wine is heavily taxed here. That didn't stop us. We got something from one of my favorite areas of the world, South Italy, which is maybe as hot as it is here right now. It's about 90 degrees out and super humid. This is the Vignetti del Salento, Primitivo di Mandora the Zola name from 2012. Now, Primitivo is a grape from Apulia, the heel of Italy, but it's actually the same grape as American Zinfandel, and actually the, the same grape as a Croatian grape, which I can't pronounce the name. They're all the same grape, so it's very similar. Primitivo Southern Italian Reds, if you're following me on Pavino, you'll see that's my most scanned wine because I love Southern Italian Reds. I think they bring a lot of heat for the money. This thing is no exception. I think in the U.S. we're looking at this being a $20, $25 wine. Uh, this Primitivo is big. It's a big, bold, dark, inky wine. A lot of fruit, a little bit of vanilla, a little bit of oak, but with big Zinfandels like this, it's, they're very full body. You're going to get a certain richness on the mouth. It's almost like a, it's almost like heavy cream versus skim milk. You're going to get a heck of a lot of dark fruit. A lot of dark fruit, a lot of plum, a little bit of licorice. Primitivo in southern Italy used to be a little bit more earthy, but now they're moving towards the way of the same kind of style as California Zinfandel. So a lot of fruit, real big, high alcohol. This is 14%. This was, this bottle right here, maybe it wasn't stored the best. To me, it was pretty good, it wasn't fantastic. I would put that at about 87 points. I think it's good value for money, just wasn't spectacular. But that's not gonna stop me from drinking Southern Reds from Apulia and from South Italy. I think they are a lot of value for the money, definitely worth your attention. Thanks for watching this video. Like again, I'm sorry that the audio is crappy. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Exotic Wine Travel, and I'll see you in the next video.